So for today's reading in my daily devotional, guys, so I will show you to you. I will show you this daily. Yeah. So we will study the Word of God, the spiritual food. So today's reading is uh, uh, Genesis chapter one, one to five. The, the restaurant was lovely but dark. Only one small candle flickered on every table. To create light, dinner dinners used their smartphones to read their me menus, look to their table mates, and even to see what they were eating. Finally, a patron quietly pushed back his chair, walked over to a waiter, and asked a simple question. Could you turn on the lights? Before long, a warm ceiling light flashed on and the room erupted with applause, So, but, but also with laughter and happy chatter and thank yous. My friend's husband turned off, turned off his phone, picked up his utensils, and spoke for us all. Let there be light, let's eat. Our gloomy evening turned festive with the flick of a switch, but how much more important to know the real source of true light. God himself spoke those astonishing words, let there be light. On the first day, he created the universe, and there was light, Genesis 1, 3. Then God saw that the light was good, verse 4. Light expresses God's great love for us. His light points us to Jesus. The light of the world, John 8, 12. Guide us from the gloom of sin. Walking in his light, we find the bright path to a life that glorifies the sun. He is the world's bright, brightest gift. As he shines, may we walk his way. So guys, that is that is for the, mes uh, the message for today is about light. So we must uh, turn on our light. So where the... So, kadalasan yung lights natin, saan ba natin i-turn on yan? So, we must turn our lights in the dark. So, kadalasan sa atin, ano, nahirapan tayo mag-turn on ng lights natin. So, we must ask God, we must pray to God that na magawa, nat magawa sana natin yung, yung pag-ilawin sana natin yung mga sarili natin. Dahil, kailangan, kailangan talaga yung, ano, yung lights na yun sa buhay natin. So yung restaurant, yun ang strategy nila, yung yung ano, they the, the strategy is they are only they use their smartphones and yeah, they use their mobile to 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 create lights. So one guy is uh, he wants the lights to turn on so they can they can eat well. So so they are having fun. So let there be light. So bawat isa sa atin kailangan ng light. So ano natin yung lights natin? Shy, ipa-shine natin yun to those who are needy. So kailangan natin yun sa sa pang-araw-araw natin boy lalo pat sa sa as for me uh, being mother so kailangan ko ng lights being a wife kailangan ko ng lights from God so yung yung lights na yun at saka ano din wag nating wag nating ano limitahan yung light natin kasi ano wag tayong maging selfish kasi somebody needs us di ba yeah. we are the army of God so maybe some someone needs our lights out there di ba we don't know who's that person is so for today's videos just comment down below in comment section so we have question here so the question goes this way in what situation do you need christ christ light to shine so in what situation do we need christ uh, light to shine so uh, comment down below your answer what what situation do you need uh, uh, jesus christ to light shine in your life so and the second one is when was when has his light guided you so yun ang second question so before we before we we end up this video uh, sana may natutunan tayo sa araw na ito lalo pat sa marami na ta maraming mga ano struggle along the way yung crosses natin we need to take up our crosses in order for us to ano magawa natin yung 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 tama na gusto ni Lord para sa atin at saka huwag natin kalimutan na, na kung may may mayroon mang ano excuse me mayroon mang time na madilim so we need to seek help so every time we need to seek help and that help is uh, from god from the lord so we alone we are nothing so god is everything so as a closing a closing uh, prayer we will uh, say a little prayer before we end so loving god we thank you for jesus the light of the world and the guiding light of his great love thank you for this time father god thank you for always being there thank you for all of us for for the fellowship thank you for my husband my daughter and thank you for all my friends that you provided me 
Thank you for all my families. Take care of them, Father God. Bring them closer to you. In Jesus' name we pray with thanksgiving. Amen. Okay, bye-bye guys. And have a great day. Have a great weekend. It's weekend again. Yeah, don't forget to go to church. So maybe in, in church, uh, maybe I will just make some video um, or a little bit I will share to all of you. So, so sa church, bawal yung video sa church namin. So, di, ano, ano na lang. So, kung ano na lang yung, kung ano na lang yung, ano, kung ano yung meron, yun na lang ang isi-share ko. Kasi, I need to cook up with everything. Yeah, yung requirements ng, ng daily living. Yung, pati, pati yung, ano, youtube ko. Sana magawa ko. So, bye guys. Uh, ingat, take care, and thank you.